Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rachel. That is the R in the RK Stumbling Bear, and I am a reader and a writer. I'm here to introduce the team that I am on this year for the self-published science fiction contest. Introduced my other six judging mates, and then to talk about the books that I am reading for this contest and go over just kind of how we're doing things. So this year I am on the team Ground Control to Major Tom. This is a new team for me and I did not know that reference until one of my teammates mentioned a David Bowie song and then I went and listened to it. So now if you want to know the reference you get to go find that. Cool thing about that song is it did come out in 1969, the same year as Walking on the Moon. Our team lead is Roger Cadenhead, who is a programmer and computer book author who has been a part of the self-published science fiction contest since it began. They write their reviews on their website, Science Fiction News, which also the link to the full book list that we have will be that to his website. And he says that the picture that he has given me is reasonably recent. And he is not the only author that we have on our team. We also have E.L. Montague, who will be doing his reviews on Goodreads. And you can also find him on Twitter, which I know has been rebranded to X, but to me, my brain still says Twitter. We also have the author E.W. Doc Paris, and he is on many different places. So I have his blog, his Goodreads. It and other social medias linked down below. We also have the author Jake Morrison. He's planning to write most of his reviews on his Substack, but also Amazon slash Goodreads. And then one of my teammates is Rick. I don't know anything else about him, but he is planning to write his reviews on Goodreads. And then we have Kate Simpson, who this is their second year judging Specfus or Space 4 whatever the nickname is this year. They are from Leeds in the UK. They're a biomedical scientist, and you can find them at Twitter, at Kate Simpson, but they mostly review on Goodreads. So that is the team that I have joined this year. I'm very excited. Now for our judging process. My team has decided to go with the scout method. So that is where we are trying to have every book read in full by at least two members of our team before we choose our quarter finalists that we will read all in full. The hope is that more eyes on each book will happen. And our team started off with us choosing five books that we were interested in and then after everybody had selected five, those of us who felt we had the capacity and time to read more than five went ahead and signed up for more books. So I have signed up for nine, and I'm just going to show you the nine that I have chosen. I'm not going to go into details about why I chose them or their synopsis at this point of time. Like I said, I have linked down below the full post of from Rogers Cadenhead. And I think they do a really, really great job of introducing you to all the books that we have been allocated. So the nine that I have chosen is Alien Dissonance by Wendell Warman, A Friction by S.J. Lee, Planet of Lies by Ellie J., The Descendants of Prontoth by Mark Raines, Unexpected Witness by M.J. Blayhart, Drowning Earth by Sean Wilson, Grave Cold by Shannon Knight, The Lazarus Men by Christian Warren Freed, and Near Skies, Lonely Ship of the Accord by Ewan Stone. Personally, I'm just proud that the books I chose are not all space opera, since that is my favorite subgenre of science fiction. Now, for how I plan to review, I do plan to write reviews at Goodreads and Storygraph, and then also to talk about the books here on my channel. They will be talked about in my normal monthly wrap-ups for the months that I finish them, but I'm also planning on doing a video after I've read five, then specifically talk about those five that I have read. That way there can be a highlighted self-published science fiction contest post about the books. Easier to find. Again, when I finish my other four, or if I read more, I will bundle those as well. 
If you have read any of these nine already, I'd love to know about it. If not, that's okay. If you have looked at the full list of all the books for this contest, I would love to know which ones are most interesting to you that you would like to read, whether or not they're on my team or somebody else's team. I did look at the full 188 list as it was coming through before we got our allocations. So I know that I definitely have other books marked as want to read that are on. And I'm not just babbling now. So please stick around. This is a great contest to follow, especially if you love science fiction. Thank you and have a great day.